The benefits can be a make or break deal for applicants or current employees. After the trucking company Yellow Corporation laid off thousands of employees across the country, Arlena Bleeds talked to two former local employees about what they had been willing to give up over the years and the one thing they refused and their union refused to concede. It's tough. It's devastating. After 26 years of working at Yellow Corporation and Nina, Todd Schwartz and his former colleague Dan Getzfried are among the 30,000 employees the trucking company suddenly terminated this month. You go from a normal everyday job for all those years to less than 24 hours notice, don't report for work. The men say over the past decade, Yellow Corporation pushed for a 15% pay cut, reducing pension contributions and vacation time. Then the company received $730 million in federal loans three years ago during the pandemic. The wages weren't our most important thing. We wanted insurance. We wanted our pension taken care of. The Teamsters Union representing Yellow employees was pushing for the company to reopen contract negotiations. Die hard union. Die hard union. Todd and Dan both said that they've seen a lot of criticism across the country of the union. They say that they've seen people blaming the union for what's happened here at Yellow and being shut out of their workplace. But for them, their loyalty completely stands behind Teamsters. Support the Teamsters right to the end. Getzfried says there was one thing employees were not willing to give up. The biggest devastation, I believe, is the insurance. Currently, we have employees dealing with cancer. We have employees having babies, people with surgeries, long-term illness. Everybody understands what the medical costs are. Todd and Dan were prepared to go on strike, but then learned the business was closing. Now they're left to figure out what's next. In Nina, Lena Bleitz, Action 2 News.